Namaste, we got July 3rd, 2009. We're here in, uh, ¿cómo se llama la selva aquí? La Candona. <laughs> <laughs> la selva de Coba. La selva de Coba, and this is, uh, we're about to descend into a subterranean cenote here on the Yucatan Peninsula, out by the Coba ruins, and uh, this, this is the vibe. Here we go. Here we go. Underground. Um, Today is uh, July 3rd, 2009, and uh, I'm here in uh, one of the cenotes outside of Coba in Quintana Roo, one of the states on the Mexican peninsula, the Yucatan Peninsula, and this is uh, a pool that's part of a beautiful underground river system connected by caves and tunnels of water. And uh, this is just incredible. It's just quiet and gorgeous. These inner tubes are just floating around here for people to use when they come. There's a couple of fish in the water. It's like living geology all around you. Got stalactites hanging from the ceiling and little catfish swimming in the water. You can see the roots of trees above that have just been penetrating the layers of rock above us and slowly growing and making their way down into the uh, water system. Totally fresh. And then there's the uh, There's the whole Pangeali element here in which sort of forces you to, or it doesn't force you, but it introduces you to this whole subterranean world that we never really get to encounter. And we always walk upon the Earth's surface and have very little understanding of what's happening below it. And wrapped up in the whole concept of Pangeality is capturing images and ideas that help to push our understanding of the world around us and challenge us to think about the world in ways that we weren't previously familiar with. And this certainly has that power. Namaste. 